<coughs> Hello, y'all. For a common man, with common sense, to a common woman, with common sense, to a prepper with common sense of thinking. This is what I did when I was at Metrolina Greenhouse. And I didn't have no problem in none of my stuff. That's why I wanted you to see what I was talking about. This is what we used at the greenhouse. We wanted these people to figure out what to do and how to do it on certain things. Trying to make it where you can read a little bit. So I put it down so you can easily understand what you're doing. It saves you a lot of time and you can get a perfect garden going. These are just some of the plants I played with and people had problems with every year. No matter which way it goes, they did it every year and I did pretty good. So I'll let you read what I was doing. How about that? It gives you a pertinent understanding of what you're really up against. When you're in the garden, up here let you see what it's saying so you see what we did everything you can usually find is not that hard but you got to do everything that they say that what makes it so hard But most guys didn't pay attention, so I sat there, I made that very plain and blunt so they could understand what they were doing. easier learning this this way than it is sitting there trying to hear a guy talk and you have to go back and watch the video over and over again when you can sit there and write this stuff down how to have a perfect area on certain things you know what they are see what I'm saying and we didn't get half the time I didn't have no problems That's talking about mm, about 40,000 tomatoes every year. Didn't have a problem with them. So each one that I show you is what I did to get them to grow. Can you say you're stealing anything? So this is a lot damn easier. If you go by step by step, you know what you're doing. You don't have to worry about too much.
Boy Scouts wouldn't even think about it like that. But then you start figuring out what we're doing. That really messes everybody up. Here they can't say shit because you're doing everything that I'm showing you step by step. And then you understand why we got tips and everything. Don't kill you, this actually helps you out. That's how much box we'll be doing. I hope this helps y'all out on y'all's plants, y'all the ladies, because this will save you a lot of time learning this way than that way. So I put it in there so you can read it. See what I'm saying? Spring, summer, fall, you're learning everything that a greenhouse does. And you do know what sunflowers are. Let's get into how to grow it. fast y'all read so that's why I'm doing it kind of slow so you can understand it but you learn from a greenhouse guy so you can figure out what you're doing it really helps you out a lot Ain't gonna be no pinball. I ain't gonna sit there and try to tell you and slap everything around and mess you up when you're trying to figure out it. I'm just letting you see what we did and how we did it. At a greenhouse, it covers about five states. I think we're pretty damn accurate on what we do. And at least you got to see what I was working on while I was working in the garden in main trial. I had to go through there, check, recheck, check, recheck, check, recheck, check, all the time. Never had a problem with my plants. I still don't want to get there to figure out, but all I did was just go by what they had in there guy who started it 
he was German, and he also had the guy who founded the business, the Metroline Greenhouse. He was from Switzerland. But then they find out where they was born, and the boys didn't like that because they didn't know they was actually Vikings back in them days. But that old man had me in there doing all this good shit. Now you see what I was doing. Helps you out a lot, boy. When you learn about this stuff. This helps y'all learn how to grow. Words you can't see, you can pertinent know what they're saying when you're reading it. It's kind of blurry, you can actually put the words together yourself. Like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. This is how you do stuff. Most people don't pay attention to it. Most of them don't give a shit. And that's the difference. Bye-bye.